Okay, so that was Aneurysm by Nirvana. I absolutely love this song because it's basically the song that got me back into Nirvana after having not listened to them for literally years. Um, I stopped listening to Nirvana basically when I was still at school, like maybe last year of school kind of thing, like 2002. And I didn't really listen to them again until maybe 2008, something like that. So um, that's quite a long time, I guess. Um, as I've said before in previous videos, I do remember hearing Nirvana quite a lot when I was a kid, like in the 90s. Um, you know, on MTV and on the radio and stuff like that. But I didn't actually buy any of their albums until I was about 13 or so. That's when I started buying albums. And I think uh, Nevermind was probably the second album that I actually ever bought. So um, that's kind of cool, I guess. Um, that really kind of like opened my eyes to Nirvana and um, yeah, I ended up buying In Utro after that as well, which is also an absolutely wicked album. So um, at that age I was quite set like for Nirvana kind of thing, I wasn't really aware of much of their other stuff. It was mainly um, Nevermind and In Utro, as I just said. So like I said, I hadn't really listened to Nirvana for quite a long time and I remember the first time I heard them again after all those years was on their game on the Xbox 360 called Skate and um, it was a remix of Lounge Act. I think it was like the Z-Trip or Z-Trip remix or something like that. And um, yeah, I just remember thinking, oh yeah, I like Nirvana. <laughs> Why have I not listened to them for so many years? Um, and after that, I basically, next time I was in HMV, I bought a DVD, a live performance by Nirvana, called Live Tonight Sold Out. Um, and I remember after a bunch of chit chat and all that, um, the first song that was on there was uh, Aneurysm. And I just remember thinking like, fuck, this sounds really good, <laughs> like, <laughs> this is like an awesome song. I mean, it's not complicated at all, do you know what I mean? But it's just, it, I don't know, it, it really sort of like hit home, like, I don't know, it had a, like a really great vibe to it, like, you know, the frustration and just, oh, it, it just sounded so powerful. And it wasn't long after that that I ended up buying Bleach, uh, Incesticide, um, from the Muddy Banks of Wishcar and uh, Unplugged in New York. So yeah, I, I was just like, so into Nirvana then, I, I like totally got back into them again and it was wicked. So I think this song, Aneurysm, is probably my favourite song they ever did. Um, well, live anyway. And, you know, I've, I've been kind of tentative about doing a video about it, like a, you know, a cover of it, because the song means that much to me. Um, you know, I don't know if I got it 100% right, and I always say that, but, you know, I, I did my best and, um, yeah, I just I had so much fun playing this and like learning it and everything, it was just, it wasn't a chore, do you know what I mean? It was just an enjoyable experience. You know, I, I, I was watching a lot of live performances, trying to see, like, you know, these little bits and bobs that Kurt was doing on the guitar and all that. And it, it was just so much fun. So, yeah, hopefully the video's helped you. And if you did like it, please feel free to hit like and subscribe and all that cool shit that people like to do. Uh, yeah, I'll go through some of the more difficult parts for you at the end, just because, you know, I'd like to do that and it's, you know, it's fun to sort of try and share um, what I've sort of discovered with um, you know you guys out there because you know you guys are the only reason that I actually make these videos to be honest because you know if I didn't get all those nice comments and everything I would probably still post videos but it would be a lot more sporadic <laughs> you know you guys really inspire me to do this so um, I feel like everybody on YouTube says this shit but it's true you know I do mean it so um, yeah I don't really know what else to say I've said it again um, yeah. Take it easy guys, hopefully this video has helped you and um, I hope you enjoyed watching it. Uh, yeah, so hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Peace.